Ian from Lean Media. Today I'm going to show you how to add a custom box size in Shopify in the midst of an order. If this video helps, please take a moment to like it and follow me. Let's get started. So I have this gigantic order and I found out that the uh, priority mail flat rate box is like $19 and that's too much. So I'm going to add a custom box. I already packed it up. It's ready to go. Basically all you need to all you need to do is to have the size of the box and the weight of the box and then you can add a custom box. So basically where it says package, choose add package and then you don't want carrier package, you want custom package. And package name, now why don't I just call it the dimensions of the box. So this box is 12 by 10 by 5. Okay. So I'm going to call this 12x 10x 5 box. All right. Package type is box, and then just add the dimensions I just plugged in there. And then the weight of the box went empty. I don't know what it is. It's like two, two ounces or maybe three ounces. And then save this package for future use. That means if I have a similar box or the same box, and later on I can I can use it as like one of the options when I'm uh, shipping something. So add package. So uh, 12 by 10 by 5. 53.5 ounces and let me just check that to see if that's correct yeah that's that's about correct and then it gives me the different shipping options including UPS ground and US priority mail so I'll choose one of those options purchase it and I'm all set to go if this video helped you out please take a moment to like it and follow me also if you go to leanmedia.org I have my official website there tons of blog posts and videos free stuff for you to better understand how to use Shopify or Amazon or Etsy or any other of these online marketplaces. There's no charge to you to read any of this. There's no masterclass or anything like that. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.